Okay, and next up real quick, I'm just going to show you how to edit your theme settings. So again, if you log in as admin and go to your admin section, uh, you can see down here in the gear icon, there is a theme settings button. So once we go there, we can see all of the theme settings for the current theme that we have active. These options are all going to be different based on the current theme that you have active. But you can see that the default theme has a headline text, so we can change all of this your site headline and then we'll change this to your site sub headline and I will show you where all this is going to be changed as well and the subscribe button text on the home page so if you made uh, your subscription say nine dollars a month you may want to change this to nine dollars a month or you could just say something like uh, sign up now and the next text is start watching videos now this is what the button will say after you've already signed in uh, we have the footer description, we have the sign up message which will show above the section where the person adds in their credit card info. And we also have a theme color here and I'm going to go ahead and change this theme color to a kind of orange. That's kind of similar to the current color that we have for the logo. And I'm just going to go ahead and update theme settings and then I will view the front end and I will show you the changes that we've made on there. So you can see that now we have our site headline here, we have a different color, we have the sub headline, and just like that we changed the default color scheme of our theme. And you'll notice here that the logo doesn't quite look right, it looks like we need to add a little bit of padding to the top. There should be a little bit of padding right now, or a little margin. It looks like there's a margin top of 5 pixels, but let's say we wanted to move that to, uh, it looks good there with 8 pixels. So we'll go ahead and go back into our admin. And I'm going to change my theme settings. And I'm going to add some custom CSS right here. That's navbar dash brand. And instead of margin top five, I'm going to give this margin top of eight pixels. And I will go ahead and update that. And then now if I go back to view my site, then we should see that it looks a little bit more aligned. Um, and then so we have a better aligned logo. We have a custom color scheme here And that's just the very basics about how you can update your theme settings and how you can customize the site to look more Like your brand or like your website. Okay, so that's the basics of updating your theme settings And I will be creating a few more videos and I will talk to you later